Hey, did you all know there's baseball in Israel? I am Callie Mitchell, and for Zion's sake, I will not keep silent. Hey everyone, welcome to the Judean city of Efrat, where we are here for our son's first baseball game of the season. Okay, technically it's just a scrimmage, and we're still waiting for our uniforms to arrive. But we're super excited to get the season going. Let's go Jerusalem Lions! We've been a part of the Israel Baseball Association for 10 years now, and Aviel has worked his way up from T-ball to the middle school team. Let's check out the facilities here in Efrat and see what we find. The Efrat Baseball Club was able to acquire this field after the city decided to build a new soccer complex. A friend of mine who's a mom on the opposing team told me the kids all worked really hard together to do fundraising in order to improve their facilities. First they put in stands and then bathrooms, and after that they built one of the few 90-foot batting cages in the country. The team moms were really proud of this batting cage and told me I should go see it before we left. The Efrat Baseball Club is still working on fundraising because they need to improve their lighting and make some other changes to convert this old soccer field into a baseball complex like putting in a little bit of a better infield. And y'all, I love Israel and I love baseball enough to help promote fundraising for the opposing team. If baseball is better in one city, it's better in the whole country. If you're interested in helping a frat baseball grow, look for a link to their fundraising website in the show description. This is not only a great way to support baseball, but also Israel by supporting our families that live in the settlements east of the Green Line. Well, it looks like the game finished up. While the boys debrief and pack up, Lydia and I are going to see what we can find around the field. She found this really cute bluebird box in an olive tree. After that, we checked out this vineyard located on the third baseline of the field. Next time we play Efrat, they should be nice and green. The agriculture in the Judean hills reminds me of the Bible prophecies about vineyards, like this one from Amos. I will restore the fortunes of my people Israel, and they shall rebuild the ruined cities and inhabit them. They shall plant vineyards and drink their wine, and they shall make gardens and eat their fruit. Even going to a baseball game in Israel, we're reminded of God's faithfulness. Okay, the game's over, so we're all going to head home now. It was a great game, and also if you like my shirt, it came from the Israel Association of Baseball's merch shop. So I'll leave the link below so you can get one and support Team Israel from wherever you are in the world. Alright, Shabbat Shalom everyone!